Hi, uh, I'm back again with my channel. Uh, hello, everybody. Before I start, I would like to say hello to my kingdom. Taiwan, Leso, Kalibo, Aklan, Isla de Boracay, Republic of the Philippines. Hi, hi everyone there. Hello, my dearest and nearest, especially to the Taiwan kingdom. All right. Now, I'll stop blogging now with the Middle East because I already said what I have to say. Your bling bling queen will now blog how my life here in England. My life here in England, as I said to you, the last blogging, Kevin Costner is not my husband. Robin Hood is not my husband. But I just did not realize I will marry Del Boy. There he is. This is Del Boy. For those in my kingdom who didn't know Republic of the Philippines, Taiwan, who didn't know who is Del Boy, Del Boy is a very, very hardworking man. He is very much like my husband. My husband works Monday to Friday with his engineering job, but Saturday, Sunday, weekend, we work in the car boat. We are one of the pioneer people in the car boat. I become Mrs. Del Boy, obviously. And so that's what happened, how my life began here. And mind you, it's a hard work, hard, hard work, working me with my husband. I have a children. I have a house to clean. I have a job every weekend because me and my husband become Mr. and Mrs. Del Boy. We go around. My husband got a friend who do the auction houses and who do as well house clearance where I've learned my antique because when people die, I can explain for those who live in my kingdom in Taiwan, when people die here, obviously they got items, they got old stuff in their houses. So it's resale by, by whoever solicitor, whoever inherit that, they will resale that. My, our friend will go to their house and buy it and then resale it to us. That's how I've learned about the antique. That's why I've been blogging to you with the antique because that's I become expert of antique. Collecting is my life. I've been collecting since since I met my husband and that's that's our life but it's hard hard because when you do car boat sometimes it's not successful in my story that because that was long time ago olden days I was being looked down by my own people from my own kingdom because I am Filipino normally Filipino do not go abroad to sell in the market but I did because in my attitude if the English people are selling in the car boot market I can do the same you see that's my father said anyone can do you can do so that's my attitude and I become successful with my husband because me and my husband work very very hard we go around the country selling in a car boot market and that's how I end up with the beautiful collection and that's how I've learned that's how I gain and but my we have the attitude my husband promised me not to rent in any houses so we have both a house mortgage but it's quite expensive before we got to work hard for that but we we've gone through to all that and so that done that is my life here and i'm and i'm still doing uh collecting buying things beautiful things because that's my life i never stop collecting it's like today we have the corona coronavirus but then i was so so down because as i said to you my first blogging but now i wake up again i said there is something to live for i said darling here we go we need to sort out all this stuff as i said and now i began to see and, and admiring them and beautiful things if anything happened to us with 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 this corona pandemic i said to my husband i want to do blog because at least i could blog instead of writing a book because i know my my life is successful here we work very hard we not i haven't got money we don't be, we, we didn't a millionaire we don't become a millionaire we're just mr and mrs del boy you see but 
I work very hard. I feel I have I I am successful because I adapted the culture of England people of English people. If I see if they can do that, I can do the same. That's all my my attitude. And I'm so happy. I'm I've done my life. I I made it. I used to say to my husband, I think I made it, darling. I made it. But then that's it. I have a kingdom in Taiwan, which I go there once in a while. Life there is very different. Life there is very different. Here we have the modern life. But when I go there, it's not modern i am the queen of the earth earth means land i am the queen of the land i tied it there i i showed to people there that even if you come from abroad you cannot forget your roots you've got to work hard i love planting there i love cleaning the land my my friend there they know what i do day to day that's it and next blogging again i will tell you what i do there in in my kingdom there kingdom of taiwan i love that area i i i mean place that's it. It's so much things to, to, to talk about my old kingdom. But here, this is my kingdom. We are Mr. and Mrs. Del Boy. But mind you, Del Boy, if you will watch the story of Del Boy, he become millionaire because he got a watch. I will tell to my kingdom, he, he got the watch, antique watch, sold, very, very expensive. They be, he become millionaire. But when he become millionaire, He's so unhappy. He's so lonely because no more challenge in life. If there is no challenge in life, it's boring. This is what me, my husband said, darling, help me with my blogging because to me it's a challenge. We don't know technology. We know nothing, but we can do it. We can, we can make it. And then we can clean as well the garage. Because when I see all that, I said to my husband, we look at each other, darling, this is our life. This is our life. This is what we've been through to the market. This is we've been gathered in the market all the hard work you go to the market any traders of the market will know when i see people in the market very early get them get up early and then you tidy up again i said i said to my husband now that we are in out of working now our time now is is we cannot do that anymore because we are now in the in a pension time but i said my heart broken because when i see those people trader hard very very hard to stand in the ice in the yellow and to sell in the rain you know that lot we encounter that we gather so much thing experience but now i'm so happy now i am the queen of bling bling let's go blogging that's my life that's my blogging of my life but then i want to blog now with all this now darling here we start from here this is a mantelpiece again this is 1930 this is old older very old this is what they call mantelpiece they put that in the you know where the fireplace on top of the fireplace because obviously here it's cold they do the fireplace so that's one of the mantelpieces that they do but here in the other side i told you i promised to you i told you that my my in-laws always give me crystal and this is my crystal this is all what we do i also have a butler because i'm a queen of bling bling this we had this forever for a long time so those are the crystal the canteer that we put the whiskey we put the, the the alcohol this is again the beautiful glasses of crystal you you drink your wine you drink your water whatever you want to use that but i never use that as just a collection as you see there's still a label there and this one is a bavarian cherry cherry decanter with the glasses this is come from Germany, as you can see how beautiful that is. So beautiful, the the etching they call it etching, a swag etching. That's that's as a very old design of uh, glasses. It's etched, they call it etched. And look at that, it's never been used because I never used them. They just stand in our cabinet. That's it. That's why you see how pristine, how how good and. Uh, the condition no cheap nothing at all and now we go now to my beads as you see your your queen of bling bling is wearing beads this i bought this long time ago i don't know where i wear them but now i can wear them now because now i'm blogging together with my my beads necklaces so i start from myself i'm, I'm the queen of uh, bling bling together with with the beads i love beads and so darling you start from there there are beautiful glass beads it's done in the olden day difficult now to find difficult to buy them now you can still find them if you just carry on looking at the end there that is a very beautiful statement one that is a glass beads i couldn't ask for more for having that that is quite old but as you see they are very clean condition because the way i told you i wrap them i tidy them put them away hide them somewhere and then when you see it again it's beautiful condition all of them is beautiful that is very beautiful this is my favorite this is multi multi beads but you see that they call it cabochon that's a glass cabochon put into that but that's part of the multi beads only for fit for the queen as you know 
only for me that I can, it suited me because I am the queen of bling bling. Also, this is my favorite as well. This is small one. That is a choker. They call it choker. I have loads of that and I can one by one show it to you, my collection. And th that's it. I hope you enjoy my blogging. Oh, I'm not finished. This is my beautiful beads again. They are glass beads, as you see. It could be foreign make somewhere, you know, sometimes France. So they make France do beautiful things. Germany do beautiful uh, items. Czechoslovakian, as I mentioned to you. Like I said, this is Bavarian, Germany. That is where we, we encounter before. But although we work hard in a car boot before, but we also collect antiques. So that's why I said it's time to, to blog our collection because this is our life, me and my husband's life. And it, it, it I have touches me, touches me every time I see them. I said, darling, I remember them. I remember we, we had them. I remember Peter, Peter that we know before who does house clearance. I remember all the people we've encountered. And that is our life. You see, Corona opening our life because now, before we die, I said to my husband, we enjoy. We enjoy looking at it. We enjoy touching them because the people who owned them before never enjoy. They just so busy with their life. There is no pandemic before. There is no Corona. They die without even enjoying their their collection. But for me, me and my husband, I enjoy it now. I couldn't ask for more. Although Corona is still around, although Corona got stressed, we got worried, but then we are so busy and i said to my husband at least we're enjoying our collection and my husband is winking now uh, am i now saying sign off darling uh, no okay he's saying he's winking winking that doesn't mean love you know but he's telling me to shut up stop talking and i'll see you next time stay stay alive uh keep distance and and look up each other and stay tuned Bye.